Hi, I'm Jeep Mama with my top five must do's when you get your first Jeep. Being a first time Jeep owner can be so overwhelming. You have so many questions like, what mods should I do to my Jeep? What should I name my Jeep? Where can I go off road? When I got my first Jeep, I had no idea what I was getting into. I didn't know where to start. I remember asking some of those same questions. So here are my top five must do's when you first get your Jeep. First, I believe the most important thing you should do is have patience when you are a new Jeep owner. Take your time and don't rush into anything. Get to know your Jeep. Get to know your Jeep style. Get to know how you want to use your Jeep. Hey, Mike, this is Fred. We got a buggy behind us. That's my friend, Henry. Second, get to know what your Jeep is capable of before you start making any serious modifications to your Jeep. Take your Jeep out for many different kinds of rides on different kinds of terrains. That is, if you plan on taking it off-road. If you don't plan on taking it off-road like I did at first, don't be surprised when one day that off-road bug bites you. Third, floor mats. These are a must, especially if you have carpet. You will want those rubberized floor mats. I like the ones that have the higher perimeter walls to keep all the yuck contained. I have these rugged ridge floor liners and the reason they're really good is they're made of a rubberized material and they have these lips here you can see that would keep the slushy melted snow, the road salt, the mud, it keeps it in here so it's easy to take out and dump it out because over a week of climbing in and out of your Jeep in all that road salt and mud and slush, you're gonna collect a lot of it in your Jeep and you don't want that salt to stay in your Jeep. Fourth, you're gonna to want to pick your accessory color because soon after you buy your Jeep, you're gonna see all the other Jeeps out there and you will want to make your Jeep your own reflection of your personality. The amount of Jeep accessories you can buy are vast, and if they don't come in the color you pick, you can always use spray paint. Fifth, decals, a must do to your Jeep. A hand wave in your accessory color looks awesome. Plus, you can add the name of your Jeep on the side of the hood. That is, if you are into naming your Jeep. By the way, some Jeepers say you don't name your Jeep, others do that for you. You can also add that windshield decal too. Decals and stickers seem to be a Jeep thing for most. Working on these top five must do's first is gonna give you the necessary time to get to know your Jeep and to figure out what kind of Jeep life you want before you start making those big and expensive modifications that one day you might regret. 